No fucking way did I just hit mark that! Usually, though, Modern Warfare 3 is one of those games that uh, I, I want to get on, but I end up getting destroyed, and it's usually just a terrible, terrible time. And now, today, I'm getting on this game for a completely different reason, because I do have a slightly serious topic that I want to let you guys know about, or at least uh, let PC players know about. And I'm kind of running the risk of possibly fucking myself and my computer, so... Definitely not my brightest idea, but we're still doing it. Holy team balance, hello? Okay, all right, people are connecting in. And, of course, this is a play style of FB members. Just, why? Number one way to trigger FB members, call them Facebook members. I love this game so much. Hit markers are fantastic. Fuck me. Why am I getting so many hit markers? Hello? I'm actually bamboozled. I shot him right in the chest. I d uh, yeah, uh, MSR machine broke. All right, well, I was able to play a game, and, uh, I mean, it seemed fine, so that's good. So the main thing that I wanted to talk about, if you guys haven't heard by now, uh, there's apparently this giant exploit that's going on with not only Modern Warfare 3, but Modern Warfare 2 as well. Hey, bitches, what the fuck is that? Oh, you're gay. No you. <laughs> You're gay. No you. So as I was saying though, recently there's been this uh, giant exploit going on with both MW2 and MW3 Steam. Basically what's been going on though is that uh, any host of any lobby, regardless if you force host lobbies or even if you join like any regular 6v6 team deathmatch game for example. So what's going on is that uh, there are hackers yeah. that are in these lobbies. Right, I'm gonna have to start muting people, I swear to god. So as I was saying though, uh, what's going on is when these hackers get a hold of your IP or get a hold of the host's IP, whoever it is, they essentially end up ratting your PC, which basically means that they can take control of your game, to take control of your entire PC. Here, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and pull up the Reddit post real quick. This is currently on the r Call of Duty Reddit, and it says, uh, MW3, severe security issue on MW3 PC. Please read and share this around. If you guys want to go ahead and read this article, I'm gonna leave it in the description below. Alright, yes, this is what I was looking for. RAD stands for Remote Access Tool, and allows third parties to access your files, documents, and system settings. See, now, I don't know if this is just me, but, I mean, when you play PC, I mean, I, I kind of expected this thing, because obviously when it comes to PC, when all sorts people are hosting these 9v9 lobbies, they have the kick tools open within the force host tool as well. Every IP in the lobby can be seen, so it's not really that big of a surprise to me that uh, hackers out there could obviously hack IP, get access to your computer, all sorts of shit like that. I might honestly sound like a complete retard trying to explain this to you guys, but I'm just letting you guys know what's going on. And really just at the end of it all, though, it's just kind of like a security risk and really just a warning from me to you guys, especially if you guys are hosting lobbies as well, just be careful. And also at the same time, though, I'm assuming that obviously not every single lobby is like this. I'm not trying to put like a scare out there like, yeah guys, don't be playing MW2 Steam or MW3 Steam because every single lobby has one of these hackers, but again, it's just a warning. I just figured I would let you guys know. So just at the end of it all, guys, I mean, it is a warning. And for those of you guys that really are extremely worried about this kind of thing, you guys can play clients like IW4X and uh, MW3 Techno Gods or Plutonium and you should be fine. And as far as the clients go for MW3, I don't really know how well Plutonium is doing and never really checked out Techno Gods either. And now obviously with MW2, I have IW4X again, but I don't know how much I'm going to be playing that. So me personally, though, I'm not all that entirely worried about it. I mean, if I want to play MW2 or MW3 Steam, obviously I'll play it. Still, though, if you are to play these games and are either unintentionally or intentionally hosting the lobby, just be careful. Just be forewarned. The only real issues that I've ever had when it comes to uh, getting hit off this game is by the guy 007, which I know I've definitely talked about him a lot in my MW3 videos, that he's just that one notorious motherfucker for just hitting everybody off, regardless of if you're either, again, intentionally or unintentionally hosting a lobby. He joins games just to end them. I just, I don't understand why. Bro, <sighs> that's a joke. Who did I hit marker? This dude, Markle. Markley, I, I don't know what I'm doing, Willie G. I don't think I could have butchered that guy's name any worse than I just did. Bro. Holy fuck! What the- that opportunity there. Holy shit, my heart's racing through my chest right now. Literally, they all spawned in that one corner, and I'm pretty sure I shot through like a fucking quad. Losing C. <laughs> <laughs> no! 
What the fuck is going on? That guy just got flatfoot 720. I just did it like that. What? Oh man, you poor soul. I, uh, I, I'm not sorry for that. And then of course I have to shoot through the smoke and get a hit marker. I went 55 and 22. Holy shit. Yes, I'm proud of myself. All of you, sit the fuck down. What are you doing? That was extremely sloppy, but it still. Oh my god, why can there have been a fourth to run out? No fucking way did I just hit mark that! Unbelievable! Un- I, I can't. I- Oh my- What?! Triple kill popped up, so even if I landed the four shot, I think it would've stacked. It probably wouldn't have given me the multi, but still, that would've been fucking filthy. Fucking wallbang Nosk Ender multi. Just what? Actually, Emma before Marshall gets mad at me, oh, Mike, this not a Nosk Ender. It wasn't cross map. Uh, okay. Well, that ends my run. Uh, <laughs> after talking about everything that I did today, okay, yeah, alright, I'm not taking any chances. Although it said on the Reddit that, like, the hacker would just, like, close your game and then open a new tab or some shit like that, but, uh, I'm probably completely overthinking the issue. I, I might have just lagged out of my own lobby, which I don't know how that happens, but Call of Duty. I don't know, though. I still had a fun time playing MW3, which I might still play more of this in the future, but just for right now, at least up until this issue kind of settles down, just be careful. That's all I'm saying. So that's gonna go ahead and wrap it up for this MW3 video. I hope you all have enjoyed. It's been Soul Rage. I will talk to you guys later. Take care, everybody.